he got the run, I think. But he's, he's quite a lot. Oh, there he goes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Blow over it. Whoa! Whoa! Did you get that? I got yeah, that one. Yeah, so he, he really wants my nose. Did you get him? Did you get him? Yes, sir. Yeah. All right, buddy. Whoa, you're okay. You're okay. Relax. 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 Ouch. Relax. <laughs> Did he get you? Yeah, hang on. All right, let me secure him. He's going to bite me again. He'll bite me anyways. Hey, that <laughs> is a black racer. Hello. Now, black racers, let me make sure I'm not staying in the fire right next to you. All right. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Woo. You gave me a little chase there. All right. Let's pull them out of fire ant territory. Now black racers, as you can see, don't have quite the temperament of a black rat snake. These guys are a lot more aggressive when you catch them. Now normally, like they're not gonna come chase you down if you're just walking through a trail, but if you do happen to touch a black racer, it'll let you know. It gave me a nice little nip there. Now, you know, just bleeding a tiny bit. Obviously, it's not gonna hurt that bad. I think I've got fire ants in my pants. Whoa, ouch. Dude, that wasn't very nice. So yeah, he, he's not a huge fan of me. And he really wants to take a chunk out of my face. <laughs> He's staring at my nose. Uh, yeah, so black racers aren't the nicest snakes when you catch them. He really is staring me down. It's kind of creeping me out here. Uh, but as you can tell, the black racer has a lot different body shape than a black rat snake as well. So these are a lot more long and slender than a black rat snake is. Uh, black rat snakes are constrictors, and black racers actually aren't. So these guys will just chase after the prey. They'll grab it, throw it around a little bit, and then they'll just swallow it. So this thing's just built for speed. As you saw, when it wants to go, it can move. Now these can race at about 12 miles an hour. It's actually not that fast. It's about as fast as a human uh, moves when they jog. But for a snake, that is really fast and it can easily chase down mice. Now the reason that these guys are so successful here is because you know the mice, they can go under holes and things pretty fast. Black rat snakes can follow them down there, but they're a lot slower than a black racer. So these guys can dart after a mouse super fast. And also, since they do have a smaller body mass, it takes them a lot shorter amount of time to heat up in the sun. So you can find these out a lot faster normally than a black rat snake, because a black rat snake needs to warm up its blood, so it has to be a little bit hotter for them to come out. But these are also very visual hunters. Uh, so right now, you see his tongue is flicking, so he's smelling things, but his eyes are huge compared to his skull. So he's, you know, he can see extremely well uh, from most snakes. And where we found him, we're in a place right now, it's just, you know, it has racer written all over it. Whoa! And all over it. Whoa! Over it. Whoa! Whoa. Did you get that? I got yeah, that one. Yeah, so he, he really wants my nose. Uh, this is where I caught him from. As you can see, I kind of dropped my bag in a fire ant mound, which probably wasn't the best thing, so now I can't drink my water. But actually, these fire ants, it's good that they're here. So we found him right here by this fire ant nest. He was probably two feet away from it. But fire ants are actually one cause. Let me throw this bag out of the way. Oh, hello. Okay. Seems to get a little calmer. You just gotta make slow movements. Yeah, he just really wants my nose. Yeah. Yeah, so, but fire ants are actually one cause of population decline in black racers because they do hang out in a very similar habitat. Uh, if a black racer is just sitting there sunning like this one was on a rock, the fire ants will just come kill it and sting it to death and eat it. Um, and, you know, these fire ants probably would have done that at some point in time if this thing would have been a little closer to their nest. Uh, but he was probably, what, they, what these guys do is they sit around these rocks and these tall grasses looking for mice and insects, things like that. Uh, now, lots of people do see these and they're scared of them because they move really fast. Uh, but you should not, you have no reason to fear a black racer. They're completely non-venomous. Uh, it's a common misconception that racers are venomous, but I promise you they are not. Uh, so, once again, completely non-venomous, but they're also not a constrictor. He's bit himself. Good job, bud. But this is such a cool animal. I've wanted to film a black racer for a long, long time. They do have a reputation for being a little bit nippy, but they are still a very important part of the ecosystem. Uh, if you do have these around your property, they're helping to keep control of rodents uh, and things like that that you'd probably rather not have. And also, they provide food, so hawks and things would love to eat these. Uh, house cats eat these a lot, even though house cats aren't native. Uh, and also, things like king snakes would love to eat a racer. But How long do you them. think we've been here and we found our first snake? half an hour no he yeah, at this spot we've been here for like five minutes um so that was really fortunate that was awesome oh my gosh we were just walking i was getting nervous because it's kind of a cloudy day but you know 
these snakes are once I like like I said they're smaller so they heat up a little bit faster and they really can move when they want to and they're just gorgeous snakes all right now you guys are gonna be amazed at how fast these guys can move so we're gonna set it right down look at that look how fast that is and you just see them and they're gone just like that you'll never catch them if they're racing the only way to catch a racer is is to hope that you get it when it's sitting you know kind of relaxing and sunning or hope that it freezes when it sees you otherwise you cannot keep up with them well everyone that's all for today's video i really hope that you enjoyed and learned something new about the black racer make sure to comment your thoughts down below and subscribe to my channel for new wildlife content coming every saturday morning this has been Zeno of The Wild Report, signing out.